it's not just now or next week, it's for years and it's for generations. So if a younger generation grows up feeling empowered, it's, it's huge. My name is Sarah Kalk and I'm a painter. I have painted for I guess as long as I can remember and I feel really lucky to have been brought up in a supported household. Um, being a female was never a, a bad thing, it was actually celebrated and um, I have some wonderful strong female role models but I realise that you know, not everybody's lucky enough to have that. So thank you, got in touch with me and said, have you heard of us? And I was like, of course I've heard of thank you. Um, I love the brand and I love the ethos behind the brand. I loved how thank you obviously gave me a creative brief um, dealing with the project um, in Bangladesh, thing, which would be based around working with empowering women, which I feel really strongly about. There are one billion people in our world living in poverty, which is a crazy number when you think about it, but we believe that every single one of us can make a massive impact on that number. So in Bangladesh, the reality is that gender equality is still lacking and women are still seen as second-rate citizens. So at Thank You, it's not just important to us that we're funding programs that are holistic and sustainable, but also that we're funding programs that have a real focus on empowering women. And that female empowerment is not just about women getting access to basic human needs, but it's about giving them a platform to actually become change agents in their own communities. So the programs we're funding in Bangladesh are WASH programs, which stands for Water and Sanitation Hygiene Programs. So our WASH programs in Bangladesh seek to address this by putting women at the centre of the project from start to finish. So let's say somebody's running a project and they feel empowered. The idea for me that you know, that that mother might empower their daughter or their niece or, or their mother or, or anyone in the community is huge. So the painting is behind me right now. Um, it's called Momentum. So whilst I was in the process of working through this project, I read a chapter one book from Thank You. And one of the chapters in there was called Momentum Changes Everything. For me, this really sort of embodied not only my process for painting, you know, that momentum, I can't create my work without the momentum. But it also embodies thank you sort of mission and vision of, you know, one project leads to another and leads to another. That momentum's a big part of thank you, but it also directly led into the project in Bangladesh. The momentum that can be created by the empowerment of the females that are working in the projects. I started with the brief of the project in Bangladesh um, and um, sort of really wanted to tie in the the layers between the way I work and also the layers of how much reach a project can have. So I started with a really dark sort of colour to sort of represent, I guess, you know, the struggle and the poverty that goes with things, but provide those little pops of colour to sort of not only represent the beautiful vibrancy of Bangladesh, but those little pops of hope and, and you know, that momentum that we're creating with such a project. Um, I just hope that people not only buy the product because they love it, but they also know the impact that they're having when they buy the piece. Um, it's not just that the bottle looks great, there's a whole other layer to it and um, I hope that everybody gets on board.